All right, so today's random question is, is it true guys with big feet have a big penis? What's up guys? Today is a special day. Wanna know why? Okay, because right now I'm in Riverside, right? Alright, but now check this out. First time in New York, guys. Why am I here though? Well, I'm here for a job and I'm also here to stay for a week. So I'm gonna try to do social experiments in between, but look okay. how beautiful my view is right now. Currently in the freeway, getting to our hotel. Just now arrived. Shout out to a taxi. Oh, I gotta pay. They people out here drive crazy. We're staying at the Ritz Carlton. Check it out. Right in front of Central Park. Ritz Carlton is actually the third best hotel I think ranked in the world not too sure if not it is the United States I mean cuz look what what can beat this view so the next hotel is comrade and from comrade I'm staying in my cousin Rafa's house I'm staying there for a week here in New York so be ready for social experiments to drop because I have lots of questions I want to ask people and they should be interesting so enjoy the rest of my day About to go eat so the next time I meet you guys up is when we're at the food spot and if it's good I'll recommend it if not I'll tell you not to come there but supposedly according to Aldo it's one of the best food spots out there so we'll see what happens that's our food place right there we're sitting down on 53rd Street and what we're trying today is the Hala guys so the Hala guys pretty much they give you a bowl and what this bowl contains so it comes with Beef comes with rice, it comes with a whole bunch of goody goodies. Look at that. Took the first bite, the beef tastes already amazing. Hella good. What's up guys, we are in New York City and today's question is asking girls, is it true guys with big feet have a big penis? Well today we're going to find out that question. Hope you guys do enjoy today's responses. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button right now. If you enjoy today's responses, then make sure to hit that like button. Other than that guys, let's get started in asking today's question. Is it true guys with big feet have a big penis? I have no idea. I wouldn't know. <laughs> Um, see, I don't know. I don't have too much experience with that. But I think it's true. I think it's true. You think it's true? Yeah, I think it's true. Is it true guys with big feet have a big penis? I can't say, honestly. I haven't noticed that. No idea? <laughs> no, but probably not. Do true guys with big feet have a big penis? No, it's not true. It's not true? No. Why not? Because when I was in middle school, it was this picture going around this guy. He had big feet. He was tall, but... Yeah. It was, it was, it was, it was a small. big down there. Yeah. yeah, it was not big down there. Yeah, I want to give a shout out to Kitty Jewel. Y'all go shop, shop Elico. What is up, guys? Ah, uh, home sweet. 
we home finally back from New York City it's cold over there guys it's cold by the way do you guys like the braids I know you guys saw in the previous video if you haven't seen a previous video then make sure to check it out it's a social experiment in which I'm in Rosarito Mexico asking people what your body count so if you haven't seen that video look check it out here's a little, here's a little sneak peek I don't keep up with it nigga I don't know nigga other than that, guys, um, about to take a shower because I legitly just got back. So the next um, narrative is going to be with my hair undone. Short. My hair is like an inch and a half. Luckily and fortunately, I was able to get them done. But now I think it's time to get them undone. Yeah, so say bye to my braids. Bye, braids. Yeah, so next time you see me, so they're going to be off. So, whoa. Yeah, and that's how my hair looks without my braids. Tell me, why don't you have a shirt? Good question. <laughs> Tell me, why isn't your hair done? Good question. Oh! <laughs> I don't like the shirt, so... So what's your shirt then? Okay. <laughs> oh! Yep. Yep, yep. Okay, backlash and... New new segment and it's gonna be called behind the scenes of making these videos and why am I doing this well because I want to be the first YouTube channel to be real to show you guys behind the scenes to show you guys how it is on the front line and if you guys are wondering it's it's quite hard any shout outs you want to give out no thank you any shout outs you want to give out not really. No shout outs? I have enough followers already, you All know. Right. So far, New York has been the place where I got the most rejections. It was, a, it was a tough day, guys, that day in New York. I hope you guys did enjoy responses. Um, I spent like four hours, and that's what I got. I asked probably over 100 people, and honestly, out of the 100, like, that was what I got. Like, guys, I don't think you understand how much effort I put into these videos be but it's because I love what I do and I feel like everyone should do what they love doing because if not then I don't feel like you're living life and I'm not trying I'm not saying this to bag on anyone but I'm here to be a motivational speaker and just to get you I guess like that not to if you already are then great amazing but if you're not and you don't have that spark I want to spark the energy in into you because any honestly guys what I feel like what I my brain tells me is if you start going towards your goal then eventually you're gonna hit it yeah you might be stressing because you haven't achieved it but everything is a process things takes time like that's one thing you have to I guess understand nothing's gonna be like this there's gonna be some tough times there's gonna be bumps in the road and I've been facing bumps guys but this is not gonna affect the videos I make I mean right now I'm telling you guys how I feel but I feel like this is something this is a this is a story of vloggers that people don't know. This is what we go through, what I feel like, because that's what I've been going through. And some vloggers I know, like they've had hard times too. And you know, it's just hard times are gonna be hard times are gonna happen. Some days there's days where I ask people and they say, yeah, but this time in New York, it was a rough crowd, but that's not gonna affect um, my performance, guys. More videos are gonna be coming out. Trust me, you. You never let someone what they say get to you because if you do that's when you know they won and you not that you failed but you're letting them take over when in reality you're in control of your body you're in control of what you do you can choose to do a bad decision or a good decision but come on guys good decisions is necessary because I mean do you really want crappy life I'm guessing you don't right so make good decisions Get that good lifestyle. Get that bread. I hope I inspired you guys. Like I said, what you saw right now was nothing of people being rude. But other than that, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, make sure to like it. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, make sure to subscribe to my channel if you already haven't. If you're new to the family, welcome. Tiger Gang, Tony the Tiger. And that's includes today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching again. Hope you have a blessed day. I love you. Until next time. Good day.